everyone welcome back to cooking with tk and today you guys i am going to make a cheesecake that's right i have me some philadelphia no bake cheesecake filling original i found this in walmart this is my first time ever using this this will turn the cheesecake game around for a lot of us who are not good bakers okay with this Philadelphia No Bake Cheesecake, all thing you have to do is read the directions that are on the back. Okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our favorite type of crust that we like with cheesecake, whatever type of crust you have, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. Let's get into this video. Yeah. Okay, everyone, so we have a uh, great value graham cracker crust that I got from Walmart. And for my topping, instead of strawberries, the typical, or um, cherries or something, I got me some chocolate hazelnut spread that I am going to melt and spread over my cheesecake. Okay, to get started, I'm going to take my um, pie crust here and open it up, okay? This is a ready-made pie crust, okay? So, I have that out, okay? Let me put this um back together like that, y'all. That's how you do this, okay? Don't want it messed up. Okay, now, the Philadelphia no Bake Cheesecake Filling. This is for, you can find this in Walmart or your local grocery stores, maybe Kroger's, Walmart, I mean, Winn-Dixie, Publix. Um, for, okay, the instructions on the back right here, okay, it says, step one, spoon the cheesecake filling into your favorite pie crust, whatever pie crust you choose. Step two, smooth with the spoon, okay? And step three, your pie will be ready in two minutes. So let's go ahead and let's follow this instruction, okay? I'm having a hard time getting this open. Okay, it's on this side. Now let's go ahead and let's spoon in our cheesecake filling. No baked cheesecake. That's right. This is for people who do not know how to bake or who do not like to bake. And we're not good at baking. But we want something delicious to serve our family and our friends, our co-workers, parties, gatherings, or whatever the occasion may be. Or just for yourself. You want a cheesecake today, but you just don't feel like doing all of that baking. Where you can have your cheesecake for your family on the table in two minutes. With Philadelphia's No Bake Cheesecake Filling. This is the original. Okay. And I'm using the graham cracker crisp because this is what um, you normally eat a cheesecake with. And we're just going to smooth this out like that. Okay. Smooth it out. If you have a spatula, you can smooth it out with your spatula. You can use the back of the spoon. Okay, everyone? And it is ready to serve, according to the um, container, in two minutes. So, there's no waiting, no sitting it in the fridge, waiting to adjust it. If your husband be like, babe, make a cheesecake. You go into Walmart, you be like, okay, hun. He's going to thank you, slave, over that stove all day. Or for um, the holidays. You know, when the holidays come up, like Thanksgiving or Christmas time, or um, the 4th of July, Labor Day, or whatever it is, and someone says, okay, Susie, we want you to bring the cheesecake to the party. Well, guess what? 
Susie's going to be able to bring that cheesecake to the party. Okay? No. No hard work, Susie. Smith, Sam, Jordan. <laughs> I'm just calling out names. Um, and no hard work for me either. Okay. So we have that. And we're going to have that. Let me taste this, y'all, off my spoon. Mm. Mm. This really is a good cheesecake filling. It's just regular. Original cheesecake filling. But that tastes really, really good. Okay, next step for what I'm going to do with mine is I'm going to melt this um, hazelnut chocolate spread. And I am going to drizzle it across the top of my cheesecake. And I'll be back to show you the drizzle. Okay, everyone. <clears throat> if you guys were here to feel this, you can see that this cheesecake has really set up in two minutes. Okay, so I have melted my chocolate hazelnut spread. I added a little milk to it, <clears throat> stirred it up, and I melted it in the microwave. It is still hot, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to um, drizzle this across my cheesecake, okay? I'm not going to, um, I'm just going to drizzle it across there like so, okay? This is for the chocolate lovers out there now if you still like your strawberry topping everyone you can do that whatever topping you choose for your cheesecake but I chose this chocolate hazelnut spread and I got that chocolate hazelnut spread for one dollar at Walmart okay Just spread it like so. Or you can drizzle it any type of design that you choose. Or you choose that you like for your cheesecake. Your no-bake cheesecake recipe. Okay? If you want to choose to put you some topping on there. Um, peanuts. Or walnuts. Because that goes great. Or crush you some... Um, Oreos or some chocolate candy up for design once you get ready to plate it up it's going to be so delicious you guys trust me so delicious so let's go ahead and let's cut us a slice and let's plate this up okay everyone I appreciate you guys for joining me in making this simple easy no baked cheesecake that doesn't take time you can have you a cheesecake on your table in less than two minutes for your family. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. I will reply to your comments. I enjoy speaking to each and every one of you. And go out today, purchase you some Philadelphia cream um, cheesecake pie filling. Get whatever type of crust you like and make you a no-bake cheesecake. Thank you and have a great day.